You have a problem? You could say that. My champion, the Thracian bear, escaped. He's a trained killer. Mad as a hyena on heat. There's a bounty on him. Good money if you survive. Why do they call him the bear? Not so fast, Egyptian. I will only hire you if you show me you are capable of ripping the bear apart. Let us see how you fare against some of my best fighters. Live, and we will talk. Polymestor, the deadly son of a bitch, fought in arenas all across the Republic. He won me a fortune. In return, I treated him like a king. The best food, the best horse. <laughs> Perhaps he valued freedom more. I earned my freedom through sweat and blood in the arena, not fleeing like a coward. Look, I don't care if that pox-ridden Canus lives or dies, but he stole my sword. Caesar gave me that in my final fight, and I want it back. Julius Caesar. You know another Caesar? All right, lads, come show this Egyptian some Roman courtesies. <laughs> I have killed you. Roman soil is dry. Let's water it with Egyptian blood. <laughs> now that was a show. You are a warrior. Have I proven myself? Yeah, all right, don't get cocky. Rumor has reached me a farm east of Cyrene was attacked. Start there. That Thracian dogshagger won't come quietly. But the reward's for the weapon. You understand? I will find your champion and your trophy. <laughs> Such confidence. I like it. I might even shed a tear if he guts you. What happened here? I must find Polymestor. They shot him in the back. Was he trying to escape or hide? Polymestor did not kill these people. They helped him. Maybe he reached the fishing village. Whoa. I'm looking for a gladiator. The Thracian bear. Another of the Lanista's cronies. How much did he pay you to slit my throat? He only wants his sword. Yes, covered in my guts. How did you find me? The farmers? I am sorry, Polymester. Your friends are dead. This is the Lanista's doing! I gave him my life, and now I will take his! I threw the sword in the sea. Take it! It has brought me nothing but bad luck. The Lanista sword. I should talk to Polymaster. Where's my sword? Who do it? No, no. Ah! 
That was a battle to make Sharon weep. Thank you. Uh... Bayek. Bayek. That bastard had no code. I earned my life back a thousandfold, but I made too much coin for him. In the arena and the rich Roman beds. Keep Caesar's sword. It belongs to one who stands for freedom and honor. Thanks. I will stain it with the proper blood. The deserving blood. What will you do? Fish, mend my nets and find a good, plump woman to settle down with. I will make the most of this new life. Still shall we rise again. The order For the rarest. Get many Egyptians in Cyrene. You'll get no judgment from the mouse, but you did stick out. The mouse? An odd title, my friend. Yes, yes, I am the mouse, because I can access the more hard-to-find trinkets. If you follow me to my shop, I'll show you. Our bows, blades, scepters, you won't be disappointed. The mouse guarantees it. Sir... Bayek. All right. Let's see what you have, Mouse. Don't you have trouble with the Romans? Well, you know what they say about our Latin friends? The Greeks invented the threesome, and the Romans added women. <laughs> Besides, I know how to stay hit and serve Bayek. With the way I look, I have to. People think the Mouse is unlucky. They don't see I am an entrepreneur and... That's him! The Mouse! Dirty <laughs> No, no! The soldiers have found my shop! <laughs> the Roman swine must have taken my chest to the barracks. Please, will you recover it? And why would I do that? Because you know what it's like to be brushed aside, victimized by those who hold themselves above you. The mouse will die on the streets with no living to support him. And what of the children? Will no one think of the children? And I could probably spare a fine reward for my savior. I would not want the children on my conscience. Gods bless you, Sir Bayek. I will wait for you in the market behind the paths. Good luck, my friend. Mouse's stash. <sighs> ah, Bayek, did you find my chest? You have saved my life for a second time, Sir Bayek. I am blessed, blessed by the gods who brought you to me on this, the greatest of days. The mouse will embrace you as a sign of my undying gratitude. Ah, uh, please don't. Then money, I will shower you with riches to make Chris's jealous. Take care of yourself, mouse. Try not to get caught in any more traps, eh? Ah, such grace, such wit. You deserve more than mere money. Come see me again later. I will find you something special from my stash. I ever witnessed, and I once saw a snake swallow a cat whole. A cat? Really? 
And who are you? Esiocles. But all my friends call me Esio. Well, Esio, I am Bayek. How did you do that? Are you magic? Will you leave some more for me and my friends? I can tell you about my home, the most amazing city of Cyrene as we go. How can I refuse such a gracious offer? Lead the way, Esio. Me and my gang will give you the grand tour, Bayek. You have a gang? Yes, I'm the most important child in Cyrene. I can see that, Esio. Let's go to the baths. It's where people walk around naked, being scraped and scratched and rubbed with oils. I hate getting my hair wet, don't you, Bayek? It is why I shaved it off, Esio. And washing behind the ears, I bet. <laughs> yes, some fancy Roman from the Citadel built it. Be much for some way you wash. When I grow up, I'm going to have a wife who'll never make me wash. Oh. Wives like that are hard to find, Esio. I could do that with my eyes closed. Come on, everyone. Come see Bayek fly. No one can climb that high, can they? See? Didn't I tell you he was brave? Oh, my days. What if he falls? Some oh. of those scaredy cats thought you missed the car. I have never cup. seen the light. I never doubted you. It's impossible, I wasn't right? sure myself, as you. He swoops through the air so like next? an eagle. You're Egyptian, right? My father says you don't worship the same gods oh. as we Greeks. We have some in common, like Serapis. Oh yes, Serapis. I've heard of him. Apollo is all <gasps> Greek and my favorite. He likes poetry, music, wine, Ooh. and all that kind of stuff. But I like him because he has a bow and arrow and he likes to hunt. Do you like to hunt, Bayek? I do. Oh. I used to hunt with my boy, Esio. If you jump from his <gasps> temple there, then maybe he'll be watching from Mount Olympus and reward me with my own bow and arrow so I can hunt rabbits in the woods. I would like to see that. Ah. Oh. This is it. Isn't the polo marvelous? Well, that depends. You did it! You did it! Our friend Bayek does the impossible! Let's go to the next jump. Well, you did promise a challenge, Essio. Nobody's allowed up there except the Romans. But you look like you can handle a few measly bucket heads. Are you ready, Bayek? I present the Acropolis. Ah, uh, they will attack on sight here. Treasure it. Goodbye, Esio. Stay out of trouble. I can't promise, but I will try for you, Great Flea. I hope you get to hunt with your son again soon. So do I, Esio. Mouse? They are going to kill me! 
Shut up! You're convicted of murder! They have the wrong man! I was as innocent as a babe! What trap has the mouse fallen into now? Hold on, mouse. Stop your mouth, or I'll stop it for you. Dead man walking! This murderer will be punished with the full weight of Rome! The murderer of the moneylender Paulus Aurelius has been apprehended! The streets they are of Sarina are murder. safe again! Me! I value life! There is a real murderer out there. He's killing my friends! Slow down and tell me what happened, Mouse. I was at the bathhouse, meeting some associates, and suddenly a legion accosted me! Didn't you plead your innocence? They wouldn't listen! They accused me of killing Paulus Aurelius, the moneylender, gathered like a pig. Red hair in his fist, not my hair. I met with him, yes, but when I left the baths, he was very much alive, drinking and whoring as usual. I am many things, but not a killer! It is all right, Mouse. I believe you. But the Romans will not believe a cripple and an Egyptian. Have faith. Stay low and wait for me at the gardens of the Temple of Zeus. There may still be clues to the real killer at the bathhouse. I know Smintos is not the murderer, but I must discover who is. The Romans have closed off the baths. I should look for another way in. Murdered. The body has been moved. I need to find it. So this is where he was murdered. A scattering of beads. Someone broke their necklace. Did Polus Aurelia struggle with a woman? This trigel has blood on it. Could be the murder weapon. <laughs> the stench of death. And something else. Perfume. What will you tell me, Paulus Aurelius? Something is stuffed down his throat. A knot. Hmm. I will cleanse Cyrene of the hedonists. My next tragedy will strike down Cyrene's greatest actor, Metrobius. And it is signed... Vesta. 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 What is your problem with pleasure seekers? I need to find this actor before this murderer strikes again. Phanos would be appalled if an actor were to die. to get rid of that lion before I can confirm my suspicions. But I think that is Vesta's second victim. Yes. Metrobius, the murderer's second victim. There's not much left of him. Another note. Metrobius took his final bow. Only the horror remains, and he will die at the wolf's den. This Vesta has a flair for the dramatic. The horror's wolf's den must be the local brothel. My instincts were right. Vesta's a prostitute, but she's looking for her father. I only hope I find him before she does. <clears throat> ah, I'm too late. Another note. This must be the horror. Father, you die. You will be quiet now, mother. By the gods, this Vesta is insane. That's it, man. And I will join you and father soon. I cannot stop. And I will not live without you. Why did you kill them? 
Whoa. Vesta was not a prostitute, but the forgotten son of one. I hope the Duat figures you out. I should return to Smintos. Bayek! Did you find the killer? Yes. The son of a prostitute. When his mother died, terrible grief overtook him. He believed a car would not let him rest until he found his father. He's dead? I am sorry, Mouse. He could not be reasoned with. I have his letters. The story they tell is a tragic one. Poor boy. Such sadness. What will you do? Won't the Romans be searching for you? I have a plan. A new life in Apollonia, where you can taste the sea it is so close. Find me there if you can, Sir Bayek. Good luck, Mouse. I love to the lion of Rome. Slender arrows are lodged in my heart. Love vexes the chest that it is. Dark skin, light step, brooding. You must be the sea one Felix raved about. It takes a lot to impress that one. You must be good. But let's not do awkward introductions. I prefer to get straight to business. And your reputation precedes you. If you've come to bleed for gain and glory, Siren welcomes you with open arms. Hey, Egyptian, come see. I heard Sarinacan horses are the best in the world. They are. Which is why that cursed Roman quartermaster stole my prized stallion, Hermes. Hermes wasn't only my fastest horse, but my best breeder. The mares miss him. I miss him. I'll pay you. You want me to rescue a horse? I love him like a brother. Actually, my brother's a donkey's ass. I love him more than my brother. That drunken thief quartermaster is probably already at the Archile Pantochion by now. It's on the road to Alexandria. Could you find Hermes and bring him home to me? Ah, they will attack on sight here. All right, Hermes. Ah, there's a good boy. So what's so special about you, Hermes? So what's so special about you, Hermes? The way your master talked about you, I half expected you to fly, eh? Huh? <laughs> uh... Ah, that's it, boy! You do feel more powerful than other horses I've ridden. Strong and lithe! Oi! Hermes, my boy! You really found him! Here you are, boy. Back with your master. Hermes, you'll get the best hay and my best bear tonight, old friend. Quartermaster gave him to the Centurion up at the East Fort. He won't come looking for him. Those forts, they steal everything from us. Ah, well, we will breed a strong line of champions from you, won't we, boy? Here is your award, friend. And well earned. Richard, help me. Who are you? Egyptian like yourself, Seni. For the safety of Egypt, we must flee. Why did the Romans capture you? For the knowledge I have. But we should not talk here. I am one of Apollodorus' most trusted spies. Part of his divine manipulation of the threads. Someone betrayed us. Gave up our agents in Serineca. That is how the Centurion found me. He has a list of names. Then it cannot remain in his hands. He patrols the border towers. Find the bastard, see what information he has, what others can be saved. 
for Egypt. For a free Egypt. May our victories multiply. By the gods. Are you mad? In combite! Rukhonos le descendas! The Magi... Ibi, you are far from Siwa, my friend. Yes, Magi. I could not stay there after what happened. I cried for the people we left behind. What is wrong with your girl, Apate, yes? Few months ago, she met a Greek lad. He was so earnest and idealistic. He filled her heart with rebellion, convinced her to help him cut out the Roman canker growing in our world. They were captured, attacking the fort. Apate strode the same sand as Chemu. Our ancestors shared the Wahat. Where do the Romans have her now? There is a place on the road to Cyrene, where they inflict the cruelest punishment. A road lined with dead rebels. Don't worry. I will bring Apate back to you, Ibi. Panamers! <laughs> no, this is what happens to filthy rats who betray the Republic! Murder me. I don't care. But you stand no chance against me. This is the crucifixion site. Apate must be here somewhere. Tell Severus from me. He's the Legion's best cop. This area is off limits. You'll scream when we hammer the nails. They <laughs> Hero. Incredible. It has been so long. Let's get free of this barbaric place fast. Those naked Eadets will send reinforcements. We shouldn't linger here, Bayek. I feared it was you, Hepate. I could not stand by as the Roman contagion spread. You heard what they did in Siwa, Bayek. I saw it. You attacked the fort? Yes. The captain of the prisoner's camp, Severos, is a psychotic butcher. Every day finding new, sick ways to inflict suffering on our people. Then at night he goes who knows where to plot and plan. While Severos lives, the rebellion is nothing but sound and fury. It was your strength and spirit that Chemu loved the most. My days were filled with freedom then. Your boy and I hunted. Laughed, lived. That is all I want for my children. Then I will kill the torturer, Apate. Look him in the eyes and make him understand that he's a shit eater. I will gather my friends. If you attack the outpost, we'll join you. is losing its greatest negative debt. Severus. <laughs> this place, this shrine, it prickles with divine power. A 
with you. I have felt your presence in my visions, Eagle. Apollo spoke of you. The king cried when he killed the White Heart. For it was the huntress bewitched, pale and beautiful, with a halo of gold. Apollo bade Gaia cradle the king's sorrow, a lake of tears high above the plains. The sun god drove his fist into the mountain, took his beloved inside, and spake, None shall seek you, none but the eagle. He will soar above the five cities with the halo of the huntress in his beak. Why do you call me Eagle? Yours is the sacred relic, Eagle. Find it and expand your riches. The Lake of Tears high in the mountains. Apollo means me to find this halo of the huntress. Divine Huntress, Cyrene herself. A crown. This must be the halo from the prophecy. I thank Apollo for this sacred gift. This messenger was tortured by the bandits. A touching letter. Apti and Merope. Lovers torn apart by oppression. Reminds me of I and myself. Poor Hapti. I should look into this. He could be in trouble. He should be easy to find with a tattoo. Start at EOC. to rot. <laughs> that is the tattoo of Ankh. Ah, poor Hapti. There is no bracelet on him. His lover has no idea he is dead. And this sickens me. I must put to rest his car and return the bracelet. Hapti's wife will want this as a keepsake. Are you Hapti's beloved? I know why you're here, Magi. He's dead, isn't he, Hapti? I am sorry. There was a rebellion at the quarry, he... No. I don't want to know. He was always so hot-headed. How could he leave us this way? I found his bracelet. He meant for you to have it. What good is a bracelet? My child will grow up without a father. Thank you for telling me. You are a good man. But please, leave me alone to my grief. I'm just another woman the Romans have made a widow. This is the war no one speaks of. In his Simba out. Whoa. Stop pissing off the foreman. Last thing we need is to get shipped off to... The foreman sent a guard to check on us? We were not complaining. We were working hard. I am not a guard. I am a Medjai from Siwa. Does he treat you badly? The work here looks backbreaking. No. Compared to the Siwans up at the aqueduct, we are revered like pharaohs. I would not go that far. Are there problems at the aqueduct? Some snooty engineer, Vitruvius. He is working our countrymen to death. And now the Roman army is involved, which is never good. I will see what is going on, Seni. 
Maybe the lash will loosen your tongue. Enough! My workers are not to blame. Send me some soldiers with half a brain, or we'll never find my diopter. General Agrippa will hear of this. A Roman, standing up for Egyptians. Pathetic. Tell Agrippa I need real soldiers who will help me find these thieves. I'll scuttle back to your wine, you sacks of uselessness. Are you the one responsible for working my people to death? Your people? They are my people. I'm keeping them alive in the face of increasingly bad odds. But who are you, my Egyptian friend? Bayek of Siwa, protector of these people. Well, Bayek of Siwa, I am Vitruvius, and contrary to popular belief, not all Romans are your enemy. If you would help your people, then help me. Our tools have been stolen. My surveying tool, the Dioptra, specifically. Without it, construction has stalled on the aqueduct. The General's idiots believe my workers are to blame. Maybe I can look for this... Dioptra. With it, this elevated river would flow into the farms of Cyrenaica. Talk to Dady up at the construction site. He used it last. Fortuna go with you, Bayek of Siwa. Are you daddy? Oh, hey, this fire. Ah, ah, I did not take it. Please, do not kill me. Daddy, wait. Calm down. I won't hurt you. Just tell me where the Diopter is. It was lunchtime, and my wife brought me a fresh roasted chicken leg for lunch. Which was nice, as it has been an eon since I had... Sounds delicious, but get to the part about the Master's tool. Your lunch won't solve this crime. Oh, uh, I see. Well, I left the Diopter in the cave, and when I came back it was gone! Scobbled away by wolves, spirits, or worse! What does this Diopter look like? Like a brazier, made of three parts. A bit you see through, a bit you measure with. I will find it. Just try not to die of fright before then. <laughs> Looks like a piece of the Dioptra. Wait a second. of the missing surveying tool. Hey, what? An 
Another piece of the tool. I should return to Vitruvius before the Romans make an example of Dedi. You have it? You have my Dioptra? I found it in a bandit camp above the aqueduct. Really? Some of my workers complained of hearing whispers from there, believed it was haunted. I was sure it was just superstitious nonsense. I dealt with it. Nothing will haunt you now, living or dead. Excellent. And now General Agrippa has no more reason to bully my workers. He's become more ambitious since Flavius returned from Siwa, and it is not a welcome change. Thank you, Bayek. You saved my... our people's lives. I am in your debt. Fortuna smile on you, Vitruvius. Your work will help a lot of people in Cyrenica. What is this madness, old man? Your eyes have been ravaged. Yes, a manticore devoured them. A mythical beast stole your sight. With the face of a woman and the body of a lion. That is one ferocious lion. Quick, before she returns. Take me to my friend Theramenes at the clinic. He will know what to do. Madness is your bedfellow. But I cannot leave you here to be eaten by beasts. I only went berry picking. There are many wild animals about. Do you not have a bow? A bow against a manticore? My bow has killed a thousand beasts. Ah, oh, are you the griffin spiriting me off? Be still, Galenos. It is me, Bayek, your savior. Are we near, near the clinic, Bayek? I hope so. <laughs> Because you think of nothing but men. Praxila has her own life. Are you the healer Theramenes? Yes, yes, is that Galenos? By the fates, what happened to him? I found him by the road, crying that the manticore took his eyes. And his wits along with them. I have honey and euphrasia, but the temple purloined my more exotic supplies. I've brought him this far, so what do you need? You'll help? Wonder of wonders, I will give you a list. Ah, let's see what the Ramanes can do with this. How is our patient? A babbling fool. We'll get no sense from him till I can relieve his pain. Silphium extract will do it. That Roman weed? Silphium is our weed, and because of the Romans, it's almost extinct. They process it at the depot north of here. Which is heavily guarded, I bet. Should be no problem for one as resourceful as you. <laughs> I should return this wonder cure to the Ramanes. You are a marvel. I will bring our friend back to his senses. Not that he had that many to begin with. If I stumble across a manticore stalking the woods of Balagre, I will bring you its head. Now that I would welcome, my boy. They say that its venomous sting will paralyze a man instantly. I could have some use for that. Medicinally speaking, of course. <laughs> of course. Farewell, Feramines. Farewell, Bayak. And watch out for manticores. How is our brave widow? Good, as you can see. Small victories and joys like these, we take them where we can. Bayek, Flavius was here. But that is not the worst of it. Mothers and wives of the temple are sick and wailing in the streets. They're pleased to see their loved ones unanswered. Since Flavius came, it cannot be a coincidence. 
No. Can you speak to my friend Krios? He is a water bearer at the temple. My task is the priestess Melita. She is overzealous, but I cannot believe she would prey on the sick and dying. Be wary, huh? I will return here when I have spoken to Krios. on by that Roman shit-eater. Whispers! Whispers! What is that? Melita, the viper of the staff. The priestess? No! No, my lord Flavius! Please! Braxilla! Stop your screeching! The sick need their rest. Braxilla! All right, all right. Just keep your voice down. She left to speak to the priestess. No! The priestess! A ah, snake in the apple! She has them. She keeps them hidden. Lies in whispers. Secrets. Shrouded. Her shrine of whispers! Is this poor witless thing you're doing? Did Praxilla tell you where she was going? The mountains. But... Look to this man. He needs help. I will find the shrine of whispers. secret in the mountains. I pray Praxila and the others are all right. <coughs> and the work will be over soon. She was a healer. She makes me ashamed. The priestess! She was torturing these people! She was a healer. She makes me ashamed. I would burn this place to ashes if I could. There is terrible evil here, Bayek. I am terrified for the fate of my Cyrenaica. Melita was mad. That relic, the one that Flavius used at the farm. When I found Krios, I knew. I could feel it clawing, digging in my mind. That is what it does. Insidious like a parasite. Control men's minds and make us slaves. Our fates are our own, Braxilla. We will always fight for that. Melita could not be saved. After what she did, I would have slit her throat myself. Thank you. For me, for Balagre, it is more than I would have asked. And that is why I give it freely, while freedom still means something. Don't you ever get sick of saying so many goodbyes? Part of me. Yes, but it is part of the journey, and on it, I find those who give me hope. Your land will not die, Praxila. You are its healer, its protector, its Medjai. Now is our time to emerge from the madness, Bayek of Siwa. I will not betray the Black Land. Are you Gupta? Yes. Did Apollodora send you? No matter. We must escape.
Roma is no friend to our people of the Nile. She will crush us beneath her sandal. How did you know of me, Magi? The Centurion's list led me to you, and another of your comrades at the fort. Apollodorus will want to know that we are compromised, and a Roman invasion of the Black Lands inevitable. Thank you, Magi, for Egypt. For a free Egypt. May our victories multiply. Bayek, over here. Why so secretive, Mouse? I have shenanigans in mind, my friend. The reward is money for you and an idyllic new life for the Mouse. A farm by the coast where I will raise chickens, goats. But... The man wants a pharaoh's ransom for the deed, Sir Bayek. But Dolos, the spirit of cunning, sent you to help with my foolproof plan. Ah, I am guessing this plan involves the Romans. And smugglers. So, will you join me on one last adventure, Sir Bayek? Uh, why not? Davis, it's surprising what for my lips will spill if you ply them with enough wine. The snitch told me the smuggler's ship has a code name. Corvum Micrum, the Black Crow. Before they dock, the crow drops her contraband into the shallows. And the smugglers return later for their loot. Yes. Here, here. How do I let you talk me into this? We'll make a pirate of you yet. Steal the dock manifest from the Romans. It will tell us the black crow's route into the harbor. I'll wait for you across the docks. Don't get caught, Sir Bayek. Gods here, perhaps the hunters should become the hunted. Ah, here it is. The Black Crow, and notes from the Roman Dockmaster. Sir Bayek, you return unscathed. The manifest says the ship arrived from Alexandria with the first tide. Ah, they'll have dropped their illegal imports at the shipwreck east of Apollonia. However, based on the manifest, the Romans cracked the cord. They will be looking too. I have turned you into a pirate, Sir Bayek. A swindler of the seven seas. <laughs> hey, I must admit. This is one of your more enlivening schemes, Mouse. It is good to hear your laugh, my friend. I've arranged to meet the man at the ruins on the coast. Come there with a plunder. Soon, that joyous land will be mine. good for the mouse than the smugglers. Hey, hang on. Where is it, Weasel? Where is the smuggler's boodle? No. Come on, you metrocoites. up like a hawk. You're in trouble now. My friend is here. I will win the bastard. 
Bayek! Kill these swindlers! He was just another liar and cheat! Where will you go now? Cyrene was a cruel mistress, Sir Bayek. But it's time to retire. You will miss her? Miss Romans kicking me to the street? Miss people spitting at my poor cursed face? No. You should use this boodle to really buy a farm you wanted, Mouse. Yes, I will. And make wine from my vines and cheese from my goats. Then one day we'll raise a cup to our friendship. Ah, that will be the best of day. Here, your reward. Thank you from the depths of my heart, Bayek. A man's heart is his own god. Goodbye, Smintos. Please save my boy. She's not a criminal. Well, thank you for stopping. My husband was a protector like you. I have screamed myself hoarse for days. No one cares. What seems to be the problem, Nebet? My Titus. My poor Titus. Imprisoned at the barracks for trying to leave the army. He is a deserter. No, a hero. He'd had enough, stood up against the Roman army, and joined the rebels. Please, he's my only child, and all I have left. I will look into it. Do not worry. They will kill me if they find me. What the query boss? Memento! I will not die on Roman soil! Why would the army lock up their own men? Papo taught me to be a fighter, but he believed in honor and justice. The Navak of the Roman fleet at Apollonia Marcella Sassina is planning an invasion. Ah, they mean to take Egypt. Yes, so I deserted. I will not stay here doing Leander of Flavius' dirty work. Where is the Navak? On his ship. He patrols the waters between Cyrene and Apollonia. Killing him will throw the fleet into chaos. Go with this, Ed, Titus. I will deal with the Navak. Cuneo! Your reckoning is between you and the gods. 